Hi, uh, Magpie Blue here, and this is Batman A Telltale Series Part 5. So uh, let's begin and continue on. So uh, I have a feeling this might be the last episode, well, the last uh, section of episode 1. So we're we'll about to find out. You assume the persona of a bat, but you're not an animal. You beat that man half to death. Uh, oops. <laughs> Your parents yeah. didn't raise you this way. And neither did I. He's still alive. He's still alive, isn't he? I didn't kill him. And in the hospital. <laughs> <sighs> Next time it might be the morgue. Especially now, sure during this happen. preposterous attack on your family. You must show the world the true nature of a Wade. Giving everything <laughs> to the city and then being murdered for it? My thoughts exactly. Every time you leave this cave. You're a good man, Bruce. Good. Just like your parents. Don't lose that. I don't mean to be a doddering old fool on the subject, but as a friend, uh, the burden of advice falls on me. Come on, Alfred, trust me. Trust I won't lose my way. It's quite understandable to stray from the path now and again. <laughs> so long as you can find your way back. You bury the Maybe person, tickets. Bruce, but you never bury the memory. Sometimes I wish I could. That so night, that alleyway, it made me who I am. I can't get it out of my head. That is your gift and your curse. Being Batman can allow you to turn back the tide of treachery that's reached this city's shores or drown you in its sorrow. When you doubt your fate, remember why you started all this. Remember that boy in the alley. Ooh, except for uh, Taylor Mark. Uh, we can't tear them up. That's yeah. We that wouldn't be right to do. So, but we'll I accept won't them. Forget. Neither will I. Oh, finally well, encrypt it. Back into the oh, fray again. It. <laughs> oh, <laughs> did not realize I had access it. Got them feed. Oh, okay. uh, I um, feel free to pause um, as I'm scrolling through so you can actually read this. So what else there is? Codex. Oh, these are. Mm -hmm. See what we have on you, Harvey. Oh, that's it. Oops. <laughs> and we got Catwoman, which now we know her identity. And we have Gordon. Uh, Vel, Vicky Vel, okay. The reporter. Mm -hmm. And then we have uh, Falcone. Okay. What else do we have here? Bat computer. And I think that's it. Yeah, so I'll just like that. Well, looks like that egg finally cracked. And inside, Mayor Hill was hiding more than I could have imagined. Mm, this is okay. a complete manifest of Carmine Falcone's criminal organization. What in the world was Hill doing with all this? Illegal arms dealing, drug running, mob hits, money laundering. Uh... Falcone's been involved in everything. Keeps, I'll keep quiet. 
because it could be anything. I have no idea if they're working together or not working together or whatever it is. This is it, Alfred. With this proof, we can finally knock out Falcone's organization. Where would we possibly begin to dismantle it? This is a police matter. There's only one cop we can trust to handle this evidence correctly. Lieutenant Gordon. He could mobilize the entire police force against Falcone. What about that reporter from the Gazette? Vicky. Yes, uh, Miss Vale. She could release this evidence through proper channels. I suppose it comes down to who you want to help most. Or who you think could do the most good. Uh, no, I don't want to do a decision. Side is it? Do we do give the stuff to uh, Vicky, the reporter, or do we give it to Gordon? Mm, I don't want to choose. <laughs> um, I feel like Gordon. He he's already on our side anyway, um, so we could give it to him. Then again, if we don't give it to him, then there won't be any, I guess, outsource, um, outsourcing with Vicky. But even if we give it to Vicky, I still feel like Gordon will still be on our side and help us. Oh, you know what? Let's do this. Vicky showed Vicky. faith in me. She cares about the truth. She'll get the story out the way it needs to be told. Yeah, I don't think she'll decision, it. sir. We'll attack Falcone on two fronts tonight. Vicky through the media, and that man by any means necessary. <laughs> Whatever Falcone is planning, it ends tonight. He's mm -hmm. spider, Bruce. Eyes everywhere. A dense web of goons poised to trap you. No one has ever managed to bring him down. I haven't tried yet. But we're gonna get into a fight. Yes. Time to fight. Ooh. And a nice fancy car. Oh, talk to reporter first. This, this is big. You drop a bomb like this, th there's gonna be fallout. That not even Falcone can survive. Why give it to me, then? You don't know how much I appreciate it, but you're a Wayne. Um, you could have given it to anyone. I need an ally in the yeah. press. Yeah. After handing me something like this, I'd say you got one for life. <laughs> Falcone's slippery, but this is enough to hang him out to dry. What this could do for the city, my career, I'm just... Wondering what the cost is going to be. Oh, yeah, be I guess we it. would. I don't know, Bruce. Help her career. Falcone doesn't like bad press. If I run this story, I put a price on my head. The next time my name appears that in the media, it, God, it might be an obituary. Um, Falcone has a way of handling reporters he doesn't like. Safe. I can protect you. I could you. be putting uh, myself in real danger by trying to expose him. I can protect I'll you. I'll protect you. I promise. Oh, <laughs> chivalrous, but. Unnecessary. You're not Batman. Or well, am I? I always think. <laughs> crime in the city. It's a hydra. You cut off one criminal's head. Three more appear in its place. I know. Unless we kill the beast once and for all. But who's even capable of that? If we don't act fast, that void will be filled by someone far worse. Um. Wouldn't be the first time. I trust Gordon. Lieutenant Gordon. He has his badge in the right place. Yeah, well, I hope that's enough. Sometimes the rest of the force, they, they have their own agenda. It's a good thing you gave this to me instead of the police. Could end up buried in some evidence locker and not on every screen in Gotham where it belongs. Mm -hmm. Public attention. That's what brings down men like Falcone. Not a bullet. Though after my story runs, he might get that too. I'll be seeing you, Bruce. Yeah, I think it's I'm done. 
Good. I trust the so report some more. The drone's located and, uh, Falcone downtown, a place called the Skyline Club. Definitely 50 50 with uh, Harvey. Like, he's cool, but. Although you're not dressed for uh, that kind of party. Well, I can always change in the car. <laughs> Nice. Mm. Be cool if I get to drive the Batmobile. I highly doubt it. Yeah, Skyline Club. Just gonna see if I'll go on. The drone's cameras and scanning tech are fully functional. All right. Let's find Falcone. Keep looking. Ooh, more things. What's this up here? Oh, security cameras. The big game. Cameras. The entire floor is under surveillance. You'll be detected as soon as you enter. No time for subtlety. Another. What's the difference between the Mafia and City Council? I don't know. Aren't they the same thing? Only one of them is organized. Ooh. <laughs> You're cute. Oh, so, uh, oh, so funny. You Not anymore. <laughs> yeah, that, that, that was a pretty weak joke, but okay. Where's Nikki? In lockup. Again? Christ, Kimmy. What did they pinch him for now? Some hit down at the docks. Nikki? No. I didn't think he was a hatchet man. You and me both. Well, does he got an alibi? Honey, I'm always his alibi. <laughs> Is that it? Mm, keep looking. Ooh, who's this? If I can select them. You make your round? Yeah. No broken bones. Still healing mm -hmm. from the last time, I bet. All it took was a couple of C notes this time. Nice and easy. Like some easy my ass. I know you burnt powder tonight. The whole city can smell it. Anything else here? There's two things. Rose. The white rose. Falcone's symbol. A red rose after mm -hmm. tonight. <laughs> Damn, Batman. Because he's out for blood. Nothing here. Yeah, we just look at things. What's that? Officer? Oh, office. Oh, office. Oops. That's the most heavily guarded door in the building. Gotta be Falcone's hideout. Mm -hmm. Well, it won't be as easy as ringing the doorbell. Four armed guards. <sighs> Stealth not an option. <laughs> I'll put together a plan of attack. Stand by. Let's take this guy down. Uh, Seated, man. Says golden screen. Oh, I guess that's all I can select. Oh wait, what's this? Coffee table. Got 
staircase, and then we have. Is that it? Oh, wait. Pillar. Hmm. Do I head him with the stairs or the pillar? the good old pillar. Let's see how that turns out. <laughs> that looks funny. <laughs> yeah. I think there's one more person, I think. Let's see. Oh yeah, this guy. So, we got... What do we have for you, mister? Modern art or oh hanging lights. Hmm. You know what? I'll do the hanging light. Don't want to mess up the modern art. So let's see how that looks. Oh, oops, I forgot I didn't link in. Now let's see how that looks. That's definitely gonna hurt him. I think. Is that it? Or is there more? the guy in the, in the banister, that's it. Um, this one might about be tricky. Me. Any ideas? I've got it covered, Al. Let's see. We have you. Who will we hit you with? Up a balcony or railing? You know what? Make things interesting. Let's do the upper balcony. <laughs> Have you formulated your plan of attack? Sure. I'm going Let's in. Very good, sir. Your turn to crash his party. Time to party. <laughs> Let's see. I almost missed that. That's me. with us. That's gonna work. I'm gonna light up this whole 
that was easy. Get your goddamn hands off of my suit! I... Ooh. You know who my lawyers... My lawyers are! I'm a respectable the firm over there. Stay down, Falcone. We can end this now. I not set him on fire just yet. What? Oh, that's not good. Ooh, go down. <laughs> go! What am I doing? Oh, whoops, there. Uh, why am I blanking out there? Explosives <laughs> armed. Fire when ready. Ooh, do we get to use this? I think I just died. <laughs> oh, that was a meant to happen. <laughs> Let's try again. <laughs> yeah. Don't want to die. <laughs> Explosives armed. Fire when ready. This should do it. Can we do it now? of his like foot on oh nah his foot's not on fire. <laughs> Answers now or you fall. The chemicals. Ooh. Where are they? What? I found your calling card at the docks. The white rose. You think I wanted to lead you here? <laughs> yeah, something reeks about this old thing. And it is a dead bat. <laughs> Still want to play games? We're all being played here, including you. Those chemicals you're so riled up about, they're mine, all right? Someone is trying to cut me out of the deal because I did not make that mess at the docks. Then who did? No, we're done. Gotham's watching now. Ah. Go ahead. Give him a show. I'll be walking free by tomorrow morning. Ha! Ah. Gotham. Uh. <laughs> okay. Apparently Gotham will hear this. Spill it, Malcone, <laughs> while you still can. It's the Waynes. They're behind all this. What do you mean? What? You wanna save this city? Well, the Waynes are the biggest gangsters in Gotham. <laughs> Whoa. That's not good. Is Alfred lying to Thanks us? Thanks for the assist. Now we only have to take one of you down. Open fire! What? I'm on your side! Aww. Always with the shooting lady. That woman in her temper. A feeling that the Falcon will had nothing to do with all that stuff. Fire and smoke could reportedly be seen from street level. Tonight, the Skyline Club, a high-rise mafia hangout in downtown Gotham, was the arena for a clash between the notorious Batman and alleged mob boss Carmine Falcone, who was found dangling over a 50-story drop. Bet Falcone loved that view. Though I'd <laughs> say the crime boss getting his is well overdue. Falcone has slipped through the law's grasp for years, but after this dramatic arrest and a stunning expose by Gazette reporter Vicky Vale, Falcone's going away for a long, long time. And speaking of newly uncovered criminal dealings, this brings me to the story everyone is talking about. Uh -oh. The Wayne family. For generations, the big W on the Wayne Enterprises Tower was a reassuring sight. 
you knew that there was something pure at the heart of Gotham, that this city, for all its faults, was built by good people. But with Thomas and Martha's shining reputation called into question, we no longer have such assurances. And even worse, it seems the apple hasn't fallen far from the tree. Gotham's greatest son, Bruce Wayne, seen here shaking hands with Carmine Falcone, may be just as crooked as his parents. In his defense, Wayne fired back saying, this story about my family is exactly that, a story. It's mm -hmm. a work of fiction all the way through. In a world where the Waynes, our golden family, are corrupt, who are we left with? Who can Gothamites look up to? The supposed hero Batman? Only time will tell. Meanwhile, we'll keep digging for the truth. But the prominent feeling throughout Gotham is that the Waynes time in the sun is ending. Definitely stirring up. I'll have to find out who's behind it. Maybe it's Oz. The suit. The car. This entire cave. Master Bruce? Everything I built! I created all of this because I didn't want any more innocent people to die! If Falcone's telling the truth about my parents, then what the hell did we do this for? Bruce, I... What have you been hiding from me? Uh -oh. Alfred! Well... Alfred better start talking now. Because something's definitely up. Huh. And it looks like that's the end of episode one. And... Uh, look at our choices. Let's see... Apparently, me and uh, a lot of other people stuck up for Harvey. In front of Falcone, what else? Damn, wow. Um, <laughs> mostly everyone uh, provided Vicky with a, a quote for the story. It's about 50 50 with breaking on. I guess most people didn't break. Uh... Oh wait, no. F I'm reading that wrong. <laughs> it seems most people uh, are really uh, vicious and decided to break the arm. <laughs> and okay, a lot of people gave the data to Gordon, but I gave it to Vicky. And let's see. Okay. So mostly have one handed Falco and he's over to the cops. And that's all the decisions. Okay, cool. Let's see what happens next time. When your parents died, they left me as caretaker of their estate, their son, and their secrets. I would never betray them. Your parents were good people, Bruce, no matter what that thug Falcone told you. Then swear to me, there's no truth to it. That scoop you brought me on Falcone helped me more than you could possibly know. I owe you one. I'm sure Falcone's taken harder beatings in the past. Hopefully this one knocks something useful out of him. Hell of a view. Bruce, the Wayne name is toxic. I have to do what's best for my campaign. What's best for Gotham. I have to... distance myself. I will find the truth. Along with anyone who stands in my way. <laughs>